How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Bilsif. I'm your host, Bilsif. Friggin' right hand, boys and girls. Peoples, I told you to do this Friday, but it's actually Sunday now, so I wanted to wait for a nice day, I did. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put the summer tires back on the old Chevy Silverado we are. Why wouldn't we? Staying away from people outside the nice air at my own home. Not getting grownness. That's what I'm doing today, boys. Girls, peoples. I'm gonna pop these off here, and then I'm gonna check the ABS sensors and stuff, and maybe clean them up with some WD-40 or something, because I think they're just dirty because they come on and off randomly and they're just cocked over. So let me go get some uh, something to take this tire off with, and uh, we'll get rolling here. All right. Oh. Hopefully, I got the right size here. I'm not sure, but let's find out, boys. Nope. Uh. Nope. Uh. Oh, careful. Thought I had an impact socket for this, but I guess I don't. Jim, careful. Easy. Decent. Oh, there's one, and she damn near fell off. He did. So if I take a look in here, ah, here, let me zoom in on you a little bit. If we take a look in here, there's a sensor right here. There is. She looks pretty dry and stuff. How's the old brake pad situation? We're gonna need some brake pads soon too, boys. So, but anyways, we'll get the WD-40 out and we'll clean that sensor in there because I ain't taking it apart until I have to put goddamn brakes on it. WD. Huh? Oh. I'm the garbage pail and put garbage. I hear you. That's what happens when we clean the basement. Here we go. Get that little square to roo. Now we'll throw the tire on her, boys. Girls, peoples. Just so you know, I did do a tire rotation. I did. <laughs> oh, we might have to go higher with this jack because these tires are bigger. Frig, I forgot about that. Oh, here comes a good train video. Frig. We're going to miss a good train video, boys. Can you see me? Probably not. Listen for it. Here it comes. We'll get her after we will. We'll go for another ride. We'll get another train video today for you, maybe. One, two, three. Three engines, boys. That would have been a good one. God damn it. It's probably going to be longer than dicks. You watch. You know what I forgot to do? Torque them. Let's move the other side first and then we'll torque them. Tip of the day, remember always torque your nuts, boys. Make sure the nuts are at the perfect strength so you don't bust one. You don't want a premature bust a nut, you don't. Frig, no you don't. That would suck, boys. Careful, wrong way, easy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I have a bad feeling that's not the right size socket. Just saying, could be wrong, but it sure doesn't feel like it. Nope. So we had the right one, boys. I've had this problem before. I have. Oh, God. My lug nuts must be fucking wore out. Oh, sure are. That's what's going on, boys. The little lug nuts are all fucked up. They're old, Jim. There we go. Another one off. Need some WD-40. <laughs> little speed sensor cleaning. <laughs> These tires are so much bigger. The truck looks so much better with the bigger tires on it, boys. Even though they're just shitty old, cheap old, stocky rims. Ugh. I'm getting old. And out of shape. She's beautiful out today. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button. If you like change of tires and bells, so why wouldn't you? It's not very exciting, but hey, it's something and it's outside. It is. All right, let's get some torque wrench and torque it. Set her down on the ground first, though, boys. So while I'm getting out of this torque wrench, I want to tell you something. I did some email this morning, trying to get a sponsor for a security PTZ camera, IP camera with about 20 times optical zoom to fire up a live webcam, not a live webcam, a live YouTube webcam of the old trains going by, boys. And I'm gonna get try to find an auto tracker so I don't have to be on the camera all the time and it just automatically tracks. Tell me what you think of that. Think that'd be a cool idea or not. And hey, if you work for a company that has uh, those kind of cameras, hit me up, boys. Put your link for your website on there for you, and uh, she'll be mint. We could do her together, we could. And like I said, oh, careful. So like I said, let me know below. That one's good. The lug nuts are deckered, boys. Holy, that gun doesn't fuck around, boys. Not at all. I actually over-torqued them. Oh well, hey. You got this. Fucking. Ugh, lug nuts. Suck the big dick. Decent. Moving on to the back. Jim? Uh, ain't saying too much today. Got a quiet day it is. This is my socket right in the middle of the truck you need. Don't think I'd have much luck taking them drums off. Well, oh, maybe I will. They probably shouldn't come off that easy. Just saying. 
Yeah, springtime we're gonna do a brake job, boys. On the old Chevy Silverado. Stay tuned for the old brake job on a 9 oh, 2007 Chevy Silverado, cause she's coming. Hey, Den. How you doing, bud? Hey, old Dennis. What do you say? He's got some balls. Count them. M18. Oh shit, boys, I forgot you over there, didn't I? You're right there, I will. Wait there for me. Sorry about that, I apologize. Get over here. Dirty bastards. How's that look? Not too bad? Uh oh. My jack hole's going down, boys. God damn it. Let's try this again. There she goes. We're gonna be safe again, we are, with good tires on the truck. There we go. Should have done this live. That way you could have reminded me to put WD-40 on this thing. Oh, she's gonna go down, boys. Careful. Easy. Gentle. I didn't torque him as high this time, as you can tell. Decent. Nothing like a little torquey torquey. They're all dickered. Oh, yeah. That's a good one, boys. Well, now that that's all done, all we got left to do now is uh, check the tire pressure. So we'll go around the vehicle real quick and do that. And then we'll load these tires up and take them around back. <laughs> oh, careful. One, two, three, four. Decent. Well, there we go, we got the tires aired up. They're all sitting at about uh, 35 or so. So now we're just gonna take these back in the back, come up front, and then I'll talk to you and see what we're gonna do here. Well, there we go. We got one more job done. We got the old tires back on the Silverado, so now it's safe to drive. Took a little ride down here to the train station. We're gonna sit around here, relax. Maybe drink a home brew. And uh, see if the train comes by, boys. One last job for the dirty old Bill Smith to do. Leave your comments down below if you liked watching me change some friggin' tires around it, which I doubt you did. But hey, you never friggin' know. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notification bell bar button. And please, wash your hands, keep clean, stay away from public, keep to yourself for the next month or so, and hopefully everybody's safe. And I love y'all. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, and you know what to do for now.